Oh, this is cool. So my opponent's playing Abbasid here, which is a top tier Civ. And I'm playing Ottoman, which is not top tier, but we'll see how it goes. I mean, if I if I try and play greedy against a Abbasid player, I feel I'm just going to get wrecked, right? But... What's the point of forbidding such things in tournaments, such as uh, feudal uh, stone walls? Um, it makes the tournament games better. What we... It makes it makes uh, the tournament games a lot better. Um, so it's something that I'd like to see Age of Empires just kind of implement. Isn't it part of the game? Um, that is uh, an interesting point. You could say something is part of the game, such as... I'll be, I'll be super hyperbole here, right? Like, drop hacking. But is it a good part of the game to have? Like, no, you don't want it. It's a very similar situation with uh, the Stonewall Towers. Or Stonewalls in Feudal. It's not a fun part of the game. Uh, so what we noticed when it was Stonewalls in uh, Feudal Age. Say if you just Stonewalled up on Hill and Dale, for example, at Age 2. Your opponent can't kill you. So what you had was very stale situations. It also could turn into who stonewall, who stonewalls who first, because you can just stonewall your opponent in. And remember, like they've done so many changes to things like, um, like rams being cheaper now and quicker to get. But it doesn't fix all the inherent issues that uh, we were facing. Rams. Oh, your, your question's about the, um, like, what about rams to break out, kind of thing? Obviously, you can make rams, but if you if your opponent, st so I, I guess um, let, let's say it cost um, let's say it cost uh, four hundred stone to stonewall tower your opponent. That isn't uh, an unreasonable like your, your opponent can't get out. To break out of that would take you a lot of time. A lot of time. That's a lot of guys on goal. Also, a lot of money. Like, to get out of that, you need, like, at age two, you need rams. Like, it's, it's, it's not a question. Like, you need rams to break out of that. So it turns into a situation where it's like, oh, you're forced to make a blacksmith, 150 resources. You're forced to get the siege engineering upgrade, which is, you know, 125 gold, 50 wood or whatever it is. And then also to make a ram, which is 250 wood. Just to break out. Never mind to do anything about it. So, like, it was just, uh, just not a very fun part of the game. Is the Stonewall Tower stuff? Okay, let's put those on there. I know we've got a lot of stone right now, but I think some extra is kind of cool. Yeah. 
But I am thinking we can... We'll do this, and we'll do this. So right now we are being about as greedy as you can possibly be. I'd say. About, about. We're getting this up and running, that is. So he's going to go for 2TC by the looks of it. Every cast again you see of Otto, they lose. They're, they're not the best. They're not the best at the moment, for sure. We'll see. Uh, we'll see where and how they end up. I guess is the big deal. So these guys take take quite a long time to build, like a minute and a half right now. Uh, these sips are coming out the 25th next month. Will the new sips allow for the Wallalo event? Don't know. We don't know. Woohoo! We got Sipper here! Do you practice new sips more just in case? I honestly, I'm just a lover of the game and I love figuring stuff out. Okay, so, that's, so he's on 3 TC. Okay, we do need wheelbarrow. I got the mining before wheelbarrow, which was a bit of a, a bit of a mistake, but these things happen. Getting some more. How do I feel about the watery work? Unsure, unsure. He does have a spear boy. I'm keeping quite a lot on the uh, vault. He's getting so much stone. And they are hardened. And they're quite powerful. Here, 
afternoon. On Muna, eat your willa. Mania, eat your body. And you're welcome. Yes, sir. So this guy's actually gone for 4TC here, which is, uh, he's mental, bruvs. Mental. I like him a lot, my friend. And that's 4TC of what we know of. Yeah, this guy is a, uh, he's a legend. So, I mean, I've been kind of greedy. Going for 3TC. This guy went, ooh, too greedy. But he's also our seed, and honestly, him going for 4TC against me, I think that's a good play by him. And he got castle before us. Now, oh, we're going to go for... In fact, go for this. If it doubles the Vizier stuff... And then it should work on all my uh, town centers, right? Technically. Yeah, this would be an interesting game to find find out. Um, how good what he did was eco-wise. Dudes on those uh, sheep. I do have a Metir. Yeah, this will be, this will be interesting now. Damn, not enough wood. Or rather, not enough stone. Let's use some of these bad boys to get us some more uh, resources are rolling. So I think he's probably walled off already, hasn't he? Oh, maybe not. Oh, 
So these are 15% extra attack speed crossbows right now, which is quite a lot, right? Okay, I'm meta. Focus down my meta. Production. Do that, do that. Yeah, this will be interesting. So we'll start uh, getting some farming going, I think. Yeah, we uh, we definitely need. We certainly do. Certainly do. So I'm gonna keep clicking on these deer. The hitbox pick. Move it like that. Also, we we want to get a uh, a mosque, don't we? Mosques are good. Good for our soul. Also, I'm going for big boosting on the mining to see if that's even a thing. Well, it isn't a thing, is it? I guess, you know what? A bunch of Janissaries would probably be awesome. If they were good. Damn, ah, so uh, imams don't count as, or moss don't count. Okay, okay, so it's only military buildings. Not just your old random Joe. That's good to know. And here we can actually get a. Uh, oh, wow. So I, I think this does just act as a mill, yeah? Yeah, it does. Okay. That's good to know. Get a bunch more super heels. Hey! There we are. As well, whip out like 10 of these Janissary boys. And we'll start uh, pushing. Oh shit, I need a freaking uh, wall killer. Didn't think about that one. Yo, we are 
Chop through! You gotta chop it! No! Don't talking please. No mic please says don't talking please. What is this? actually have a lot of gold which is good for production I guess we can get a lot of those as well I what my next vizier thing would be actually because the imams with their uh, AoE healing is kind of cool Horse up right here. And gunpowder, I think. Oh, of course. Big bad of him. So, upgrading to Elite Janissary is actually pretty cheap their first upgrade. Kind of worth noting. We're obviously going to get uh, everything that we can here. Yes, we... <laughs> 51 on gold. Good, it's good. Big power point. So the dogs are leashed now. What things do what I want? Like, this is actually quite nice and this is quite nice. Mango lads. Oof! Good damage. We're gonna use the Janissaries to heal. The big bombard. The Imam thing for healing, actually. Feels like a good idea. Especially when we're taking so much damage, I would say. But we definitely need some healing going on here, team. Definitely do. And I guess we'd get a lot of horsemen. How fast do they build? 15 seconds. I mean, that is something about Ottoman that's very nice, is when you get stuff boosted, it really is boosted. Oh, uh, definitely want to do a bit like this. So now that we've got the AoE here, we get one more, which is for... Yeah, it's interesting. It's interesting. Ooh. 
you, spear boy, are not a spear boy. Okay, Janissaries in the back line. And the middle line. Help a lot with cavalry. That's uh Seems like the shooting. That's no cooldown. Some of my cannons got kind of bugged on top of each other by the looks of it. It's what it kind of looked like there. Like this one's just staying packed up. What the fuck? It's not attacking. It was bugged. <laughs> You guys saw that, or uh, was it just me? Oh, you know what actually might be a good late game thing? This trade bag shit. Let's get, we'll get the trade bag stuff. And probably getting that sacred site would have been nice too, actually. Let's, uh, let's go plonk it over there. Oh, come on, dude. You go over there, mate. Minimal range. It was weird because I press a, I, I did press attack move on them, and they just didn't do anything. Even though they should technically try and shoot anything, right? Technically. Just strange. Angelica Asa, hello, and good morning to you. Hope you're having a lovely, lovely day. Yeah, we're going. That one apparently I didn't. Uh... Yeah, because we're going to run out of gold mining soon. So I actually went for this one, for extra gold traded. I think that's kind of fun. Just to see how it lines up, you know? Uh, get all these upgrades. and get the traders going for our gold because we're actually out of gold on our side of the map which is you know a massive deal um but if we can get some traders on the go because they are going to return let's see with 40 percent extra it's 247 gold across the map not bad not bad Oh. Oh. So, look at this. I'm attack moving here, look. And one of them decides to shoot, and another one doesn't. So what's up with this one? Yeah, some of them just don't want to shoot. For whatever reasons. 
but I'm not sure what the reasons are, which is making it a bit tricky. like the AoE healing is actually... Dude, elite Janissaries, their health at 105 is so damn low. No? I'd like it if the, these guys, their uh, aura was a bit bigger. We've got 34 traders now, with 40% extra gold than they should be getting because of that Vizier bonus. So we'll see how this works out, gold-wise. Do I need more than that? I'm not sure. Oh! One Bombardos. Yeah, they are messing up a lot with this wall. Say what, we'll just kill the wall and see if that uh, stops a lot of the uh, messing up. Dude, there's units here, and I'm attack moving. And they're attacking the building. That is so weird. That is so weird, no? Yeah, this game felt like it was filled with a lot of issues. telling that one to attack that, but it's busted. Super weird, team. Super weird. Thank you, Forest Spirit Age. Thank you very much. That's, uh, let's go for another... Oops. 
was just turned off the cat bone or something. Have a play. Yeah, if you if you make culverin, you kind of well, you can just kill the bombards. But alas, oh fuck me, he's attacking there. This game, the Janissary have been quite handy at just keeping the siege at bay, or rather the uh, cavalry at bay. Oh, oh, there's the cool boys. A bit underwhelming for the series. We'll group up and go again. We have to. Can Ot Ottomans cannot make cover and now I can make um Revolduquin on my special. Besides the Ottoman can. Put on the super attack speed. Let's do it, team. Take out those pools that are on the front line. AOE healing feels really fun. I know I know it's got like a bunch of manganel, so I'm kind of getting a uh, juice. Regardless, but. Very interested in seeing the eco of this game at the end. I gotta say, it's my Ottoman cannons that are definitely kind of keeping me in this, though, isn't it? Because I, I can't really. Can't really compete with it. Janissaries against hand cannon hits, which doesn't feel the noises. Oh, he's got the uh, corpse again. Got to run back. Enemies. Yeah, 
Yeah, my Janissaries don't have enough damage to kill other cool fighter. Just a third armor. Base. Going crossbowman? Like in crossbowman? I don't know. Boy flood against hand cannoneers. Two best eco sieve in the game. Oh, I mean, Ottoman is not the best eco sieve for one of it's a trash eco sieve, which is why I'm getting uh, the boot, the boot, boot, boot. Yeah, we're gonna go for a completely different army army comp now. This one isn't hasn't been working out for us. Lots of crossbowmen. We'll be on our back line now. But I do have like a sick trade, which is absolutely uh, paying off, right? Absolutely is. Now he's been dealing with that tower for a bit of time, which is good for us. I think my main issue. Oh, is the Ottoman cannon gonna one shot it? Oh. range unit that can get on top of his siege either, so I need to kill it with siege. You might be like, uh, oh, what about Jan Janissaries don't have enough uh, damage to pierce the 30 armor of these, uh, range of these units. They have 30 range armor, which is obviously a, a really big deal, right? Oh! 
This is one of the strangest fucking situations. I can't fucking kill him. He's dry on gold. I mean, if he had trade, he wouldn't be. Because his trade is better than mine. With spice roads and stuff. Ooh, ooh, ooh. This is the uh, the ten year war. Except I literally cannot touch him. B dot with the fifty tier one. Thank you, fucking a mate. How you been, lad? How you been? I'm currently in the battle. Of a lifetime. They did not pop up on my stream, or did it? Maybe. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, so we're from oh no, He's repairing. Maybe we'll switch back into Ottoman cannons. I don't know. I don't know. <gasps> You want me to walk? Mate, we're going for him. Unless he's going for my uh, trade, then fuck off. <laughs> Right, that's, uh... Oh shit! He got through there too? Or is there another hole? What? I wonder if there's like a hole here. B dot, how are you today? Feeling good, feeling fresh. Yeah, I definitely got quite a few of our I was on like 34. Oh, it's not that bad actually. Yeah, it's freaking heat there. There is like a little hole here. Or have they been here the whole time? I don't know. Oh. 
Dude, I've got, I've got a plan, I've got a plan. Are you ready for the mad plan? It's coming. It's coming, lads. Alright, there is a... Oh, there is a... Oh. He made another hole. We're going. If your army's all over here, mate, we're going for your base. Yeah, we are. Only a billion health to go. Let's go, team. Let's go. Let's do this. I can't beat it, man. I can't, I can't, I can't. His eco is uh, too strong, too powerful. Now, if he keeps coming, maybe there isn't a certain way that I can do this, but... Like, I have to kind of landmark snipe him. That's my only chance. We'll just use that to go and blow up those villages. Might be quite beautifully cinematic. Oh. Oh. I have, to, I have to look. Ah, come on! Oof. <laughs> Alright, that was worth it. Alright. Okay, the last stand of Middle Earth team. The last stand. Let's delete some of these uh, lumber camps and stuff. Mate, these buildings don't die fast. Like, I've got 30 knights in this mix, man. 30. Yeah, no chance, dude. No chance. You ready for the eco? So he has about 60% more food. Let's say about 10% more wood. Double the stone. And even though I went for the special trade thing, he has almost double my gold as well. Can we see the dead units? Yeah, yeah, we can see uh, military. So we kill, like, he killed 1,400. I don't know how this adds up exactly, but if you, like, I, I think military schools, when they're fully buffed, there's something like close to 200 resources per minute-ish. So this game went on for how long? 55 minutes. Let's say that I got them all fully boosted. Let, let's go with 15, even though that's way too early because I didn't do that. That's five military schools. If you say it's 1,000 resources for all of them, it's it still doesn't outweigh anything. I got all the eco upgrades for ourselves. Even went the trade upgrade. I could have got the trade age four, which makes them faster. 
but that still wouldn't offset this, and my army still isn't as good as his army. 